Hey, what's going on? You know who it is. You know what it is. All right, man. Thought I'd knock out some uh, videos on my way to the house. All right, man. Um, let me talk about this Floyd Mayweather shit. This Floyd to MMA. You know, Floyd is at it again. Uh, basically, you know what I'm saying? Trying to keep himself in the limelight. You know, I know Floyd is very bored due to the fact he doesn't fight me more. I know that for a fact. He doesn't know what the fuck to do. I wish Floyd would just take his money and, and, and start a film company or something. Like Kobe Bryant did. Start a production company. I, I mean, start your own TV network. That's what Floyd should do, man. Start his own boxing TV network. He already got the Mayweather channel. Why not just turn this into a brand? Floyd has the resources. Why don't Why don't Floyd just start some kind of boxing network where he can showcase you know what I'm saying? Old school classic fights. You know, get some licensing, you know, from these old fights and just showcase old fights, showcase some of his old fights. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and do that. And then he can make an appearance on it from time to time. Start maybe another reality show and all that type of shit. Because obviously Floyd don't have shit to do. He just don't. He didn't make a shitload of money and he don't know what to do with it. Because that's why he keep talking this absurd MMA shit. Now, I'm going to talk about the MMA, about Floyd possibly fighting in MMA at age 41. More than likely, it will not be Conor McGregor. Okay? I doubt very seriously. But then again, you never know with Floyd. Now, here's the thing with Floyd. He loves the money. And if people are stupid enough, MMA is stupid enough to offer Floyd $500 million, shit, I'd take it too. And see, the funny part about it is, even if Floyd loses and MMA gets choked out, he gonna still win, and I'll get to that in a second. Now, I know, let's just say Floyd fights, and he loses, he taps out, or whatever the case may be, he gets knocked out. You know, all the white supremacists and, 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 and coons and haters... They'll come out of nowhere celebrating, you know, popping glasses, champagne, and all that shit. It's like if all is good in the world, you know, talking all this shit. They're going to come on our channels. Say, ha, 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 Floyd lost. Ha, 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 ha. Some even going to say, ha, 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 that nigga Floyd lost. But the funny part about it is, the LDBC just going to move on. We're going to say what we need to say. We're going to talk about the shit. We're going to move on to the next subject. We not gonna lose any sleep over Floyd, you know what I'm saying, losing in MMA because you know why we expect him to lose. You think me, 7-8 Blood, Dream Chasing Boxing, Quest, Santi Walton, LBZ gonna go to sleep. <laughs> Floyd lost in MMA, bitch. You sadly mistaken. Life gonna go go on. Just like you dumb motherfuckers thought we like was finna jump off the bridge and shit when, you know, Loma Chaco beat the Laramo Rigadell. He just beat him. Y'all the motherfuckers that act like it's the end of the world when y'all favorite, you know, non-black fighter you lose to a brother. Y'all the one that get all miserable and shit. I said what I had to say about the shit and I moved on and shit. All we gonna do is talk about how Floyd lost and how he shouldn't have did the shit. But at the same time, Floyd still gonna have the last laugh. Because while you motherfuckers putting together your dumb nails and coming on here thinking y'all antagonizing people. You know what's going to be the funny part about the shit? When you get your cable bill a month from after the fight and it says $100, guess what? Floyd did won because he got you stupid motherfuckers to pay to see him lose. And then he walks away with $500 million while you guys' pockets are $100 thinner and Floyd then tallied up an extra $500 million, which more than likely officially makes Floyd a billionaire. And then y'all gonna be talking this shit about Floyd's money and all this type of shit when y'all the ones that made him a billionaire. Because like I said before, you stupid motherfuckers can talk all that shit about y'all the King Stan Floyd, he a woman beater and all that type of shit, but you still was paying 50, 60, 70, 80, $100 to see him fight. And 
I don't want to hear that shit about you pay to see him lose. You know he on the card. You paid to see him fight. You know what I'm saying? That 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 shit is tired too. Oh well, people pay to see him lose. Don't matter. You still paid, motherfucker. You paid to see the shit. If you didn't see the shit for free or, or, or streaming, you paid to see it. I wish you guys would stop it with this shit. You guys just are, are really fucking idiotic. It, it, you guys are clueless. And you may so like I said, I'm already predicting what's gonna happen. And I'm telling you guys right now, when you come on here talking about yeah, Floyd got choked out and all that shit, I'm gonna be like, okay. Cause see here's the thing, we expect Floyd to lose. Okay? But at the end of the day, like I said, that nigger that you can't stand, that woman beater, that whatever, that overrated, you know what I'm saying, cherry picker, whatever the case may may be, he gonna still win because you dumb fucks. You dumb redneck incest, fucking your sister, uncle daddy motherfuckers. Go get it paid, top dollar to see him lose. So he still wins. So you tell me who ha- who who gets the last laugh? Because like I said, you clowns are, are so fucking predictable. Like I said, real talk. So if and when it happens, I'm telling you right now, I'm not going to lose any sleep. I'm going to do what I always do. I'm going to do my video, break it down, talk about it, and then that's it, that's all. And then more than likely, when you come on my channel, bitching and whining and shit, you know what I'm saying? You helping me make a little bit of change. And you making some of the brothers in the LDBC make a little bit of change. So, in actuality, we win it. Have a nice day. I'm out.